The next strokes we're going to learn are called Dufek strokes. Now it sounds weird and it's fairly complicated, but it's pretty easy if we break it down. It's all about using paddle strokes at front of your boat. We're going to start off with a front onside Dufek stroke. What we're going to do is we're going to put the paddle in the water. We're going to provide a nice 45 degree angle with our paddle. And imagine that we've just got a 45 degree angle with our paddle into the water with our boat as well as a 45 degree angle with our shaft on our canoe. We're gonna hold it there only for a few seconds to allow it to turn our boat in the direction that our paddle is on. We don't overuse these dufex strokes because it's gonna slow our boat down. So do those strokes for just a couple of seconds and then go into some quick forward strokes to keep your momentum going. Dufex strokes only work with good forwards momentum. So you need to make sure you've got some speed when you're coming into your Dufex strokes. Your crossbow Dufex stroke is all about moving your paddle and your shoulders over to the other side of your boat. This is fairly hard and difficult when you're starting off in canoeing, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna break it down by moving our whole paddle to the other side of our canoe and placing it in the water at a 45 degree angle. We wanna make sure that our shoulders are in line with our paddle, so you actually have to move your torso over towards your paddle. You can hold it there for a couple of seconds and then go into some forward strokes. Remember, we need some forwards momentum to allow our boat to turn on that direction. If we hold our Dufex stroke for more than a couple of seconds, we're just gonna slow down and eventually stop. This is a great way of turning our boat quickly but we need to make sure we follow it up with some good forward strokes. If I wanted to turn my boat to my offside, I can put my paddle in in a dufex stroke for a couple of seconds and then go back to some sweep strokes on my onside. If I wanted to turn my boat to my onside, I can do a couple of dufex strokes on my onside and then follow them up with a couple of forward strokes on my offside. This is a good way of keeping speed in your boat as well as being able to turn your boat quickly. Dufex strokes are a fantastic way of turning your boat, but remember you must have speed.